Hey guys, so this is the second part of our tutorial on creating a URL sorting application by making use of Node.js. So in the first part, we have created a Node.js project uh, by giving or installing all the packages that are required and we have created an express server in our first part. So in the second part, we are going to give a database connectivity by making use of Mongoose. So we are going to make use of Mongoose uh, package to connect to our MongoDB database. So let's get started. Okay, so in our configuration file, let me create a JavaScript file and let me name it as db.js. So this file will be a responsible for uh, database connectivity. Okay, so if you remember in our uh, previous tutorial, we have installed Mongoose. So we are going to make use of Mongoose for communication between MongoDB database. Okay, uh, in our Node.js project. So here uh, we need to import it. So uh, let me import it mongoose require okay and model sorry model dot export mongoose okay no sorry so here we need to export the connection so we need to create a connection over here so i just forgot about that so here const connection is equal to mongoose dot create connection and we need to pass the url of our mongodb database connectivity okay so let me open my mongodb compose so everything is installed in my system so for making use of mongodb you must install Mongo, mongodb in your operating system so you can just google it for that so let me show you mongodb on windows so you can just type it okay so just go to the first url and let me search where it is okay so i'm not able to not this one yeah so here it is okay so let me just give me a second so i'll just or else i can just provide the link in the description you can just install from there okay so it is just giving me the command so i that is not required so yeah okay so from here you can just install it so you can just uh, select the version for windows or you can just download the zip of that so depending on your operating system you can in install mongodb on your system so mine is windows so i will just select windows from here and download it and install in my system okay so which i have already done so we also need a mongodb compost so i will just provide the link of both the uh, installation in my comment section you can just get it from there okay so here i want to pass a url Okay, so I'll just pass this URL to this create connectivity and in the last parameter I need to pass the database name. So I'll just here I just need to pass the database name. Okay, so let me show you. So here if I connect to my local host. Okay, so this is the URL, uh, uh, database name. So it will just create. So you can just give it any name. So I'll just name it as I will just give give a new database name so i will just name it short shorten url url shortener okay and then just export this connectivity so i'm just exporting this connectivity because i can just import this file anywhere in my code and i can just uh, access my connection okay and now here connection dot on connected okay so if it is connected then i can just print a log over here okay db connected so let me run this file and check if it is running or no so i'll just run node config config db.js okay so it is not getting connected so that's because we cannot make use of local host over here so we must provide a specific uh, local ip or you can you need to provide a specific mongodb database ip okay so local ip is 19127.0.0.1 okay so let me save this file stop this and connect it so you can see now the database got connected okay so that's all for this video tutorial so in our next tutorial we are going to create a user database schema uh and uh, we are going so that we can dump all the data into the database schema okay so thanks for watching please do subscribe protocol as point thank you